yeah, a couple of seasons ago, okay. won the league in the Ishmael Prem. Really good season. Um, obviously, with Stortford, had a great year, great time at the club, um, great players, great people. Um, obviously, last year, got put in the north. I thought I'd give it a crack. Um, very difficult to, to travel in, was very hard. Good experience in terms of going to certain grounds, but overall, it was a difficult season. Um, obviously, ultimately, got relegated. Um, and now, I'm at that stage in my career where I just want to kind of see it out a little bit, just try and enjoy myself and, yeah, just see where I can get to. Um, obviously, Johnny's been on the phone to me quite a bit, <laughs> trying to get me back. And I just thought, you know, I'll give it, I'll give it one last, I call it the last dance. <laughs> yeah, it's good to be back. Nothing's, like I said, changed too much. And if, if anything, it's got better, it's improved, so which is good. I think, I guess, it's familiar surroundings, isn't it? It's like coming back home. So just that family atmosphere, the fans, the people, yeah, it's just it's comfortable. Uh, obviously, I've played with Sam, we played with Rats, played with Scotty, and I guess it's, you know, what can we? It's a, it's like a reset, really. What can we reset and rebuild from again? So you've got that core there. People like Jardel with Ebbs have come in and taken to it as well, you know. And yeah, we've got that core there. Can we build on? Can we add the players that are going to help us do well this season and really step on and build this club on again? Because like I said, when I was here years ago, we were, we were at step three up in the top half of the table. So can we get back to that? you know, in years to come. Um, can I be a part of that if the legs can hold up? But listen, we'll see. But like I said, the core's there and then can we build around that essentially, so it's good. So it's been a great opportunity for the under 23s, um, for them to be able to step up and, you know, make a stake and a claim in the team. I guess for them, it's about, you know, that consistency, being in and around the squads, getting on the pitch, you know, impressing, seeing what they can do and then getting into the starting team and then retaining their place. So for them, it's good to have experienced pros around them that have played the game so they can learn as well and for me my advice to them would just be learn as much as you can soak up as much as you can don't get disheartened and frustrated because when your time comes take it with both hands and run so yeah very good core you know young boys coming through and i guess about them is just getting your head down don't you know don't get don't get ahead of yourself and just just keep working hard tough season you know it doesn't matter what level you're playing at football's football in it 11 men versus 11 man but I'm here for the challenge, I'm here to try and help out. I wouldn't say there's too much difference. Um, I guess, like I said, a lot of players have dropped down from step three into step four, you know, and there's a lot of talent in step four as well. Obviously, you've got the young hungry boys as well. So it's a good balance there. You know, you've got experienced teams, you've got the young teams as well. It's just about, you know, just, just apply yourself like any game, really, whether it's step two, step one, Premier League, just going out there and just trying to win a game of football. So, yeah, we go on Saturday and I want three points and to move on. <laughs>